marked as the game of a little technical difficulty. Uh, I've just uh, bought Layers of Fear for you to start the review on. Um, as usual, I go into a first uh, first, um, first impression of the game, so most of the time I want to start it up and just be fresh at it. Apparently this game needs a little update, so it gives me a little time to uh, talk to you guys. So, uh, if you're still watching, and if you're watching this on YouTube, if you like the content that's to come, please give me a subscribe or a like for this video. Uh, you can also follow me on Twitch. And... So I see that Josh and Tom, one of my friends, are also watching me. Hey guys, thank you for watching my channel. Uh, we're going to be starting Layers of Fear soon. It's on Steam now, and you have the uh, usual edition for 4.99 euros, and you have the master um, master edition. I think it's called for five euros and thirty seven cents. So that's not going to put a dent. That's not going to put a dent in your um, in your pocket anytime soon. So let's start layers of fear for you right now. And it's already up. Let's play. Okay, it didn't start full screen, so that's something we need to remedy. It started actually um, between my two screens. So that's something I'm not looking forward to. Okay, there we go. If you have a history of epilepsy, do not watch this. Or well, or play this. Layers of Fear, Unity. Unity engine, I hope it's any good. Okay, let's go. Oh, okay, that should... Probably move the slider. Continue. Empty. Oh! I'm using paintings, but I'm select the profile to load. Okay, save slot one. Fine by me. Let's go. Load. Layers of Fear is a unique immersive game experience in which every decision affects the narrative. As in life, this is the door you open, the memory. Memories you take with you and shadows you explore that will define who you are. This may be our game, but it is your journey. Okay, I pretty much doubt that, but... I don't know if I should believe this guy, what he's telling me, so... Okay, let's go. <laughs> I'm so excited. I know how you must feel. Lost. Alone. Hopeless. You probably deserve it. But even for you, there is still a way. A way to bring it all back. The one precious thing you ever truly desired. Okay. What do I desire? Finish it. Finish him. Every portrait that is painted with feeling is a portrait of an artist, not the sinner. Okay. Wow, graphics look good. The feel of the walking is good. Oh, we can interact with that. That's a muzzle. Or something else, which I'm not going to mention. Could be something from a certain type of store that you use for late night entertainment. Oh, I have to I have to actually oh, okay, I have to hold the button. Can I do that with the muzzle as well? No. It's just a trinket to look at. And open. Oh, this is great. You actually have to to, um, to move move your hand or move the mouse while you're holding it, so I think this is Probably because I think this game also came out on on a on a uh, mobile device, maybe. At least if it's on a mobile device, it would make sense to open things this way. But not much for us to look at. We can make a very untidy home this way. Nice light effects. The graphics are actually pretty good. What's this? What does it say? 
Longdale Muggly R E first. Popcall. Well, I think that's our dog. And if it needs a muzzle, I don't want to be walking or walking into him anytime soon. So let's see. We we're in this cool mansion. Nice crib, dude. Oh, apparently he was in the Wehrmacht or something. Somebody. Uh, let's see what we have. Some old stuff. Nothing we can interact with at the moment. Oh, will we? Oh, do we really have to open up all the drawers and see what's in them? Oh, that one is locked. So there should be a key somewhere there. Okay, what do we have here? Sir, sir. I didn't touch the workshop, just like you ask, although I can't imagine the mess that's inside. Also, if you care so much for the room, maybe you should pay more attention to where you leave the keys. I brought them back to your office. Have a nice day, sir. <laughs> okay. Oh, well, we get that. Okay, so we've lost the keys to the office. Throw some stuff around. Oh! That must be my daddy. Okay, not, no, I'm not going into the basement just yet. I want to build up the suspense. One below knee pr prosthesis. How the hell did they... Hmm? What? How the hell did they fuck up the length? Oh, so that's why I'm walking funny. Because I have a, <laughs> I have a defective prosthesis. What? What's that? Can't see. We have a flashlight in here. Okay, I'm gonna refund most of the games anyway, but this one I'm gonna keep. This is a keeper. <laughs> oh, that's some sick looking dude. Or baby with a beard. A bearded baby. <laughs> Look at that guy over there! It's like your uncle on a really bad family reunion. Is she holding a skull? I know the game is definitely trying to build some suspense. Now we have the same bearded baby again. Red Riding Hood and the Wolf. <laughs> okay, that's gorish. I like it. Oh, there's the key. I'm sorry, I'll make it up to you tonight. It's all about you and me. Let's make it special. You promised. I hope that note is not from the butler. If that note is from the butler, I'm gonna be very upset at James. James, could you please stop sending me these dirty messages? I know you fancy me, but you're not hired for that kind of thing. To be something you can draw in your sleep, but I didn't expect to get this... ...demented nightmare fuel you submitted for your, for a kid bedtime story. There's no way in hell I'm using this, and I always already regret agreeing to a payment in advance. Please get your shit together. You're all pal -im. Yeah, yeah, publishing house. Apparently I publish... Creepy animations for kids' bedtime stories that he cannot quite agree with. So that's all we can do in the desk. Is there any way to run or walk a little bit more faster? I am the monster. What? Apparently, my piano play sucks this much. Even the ghosts turn the piano against me. Oh, I was supposed to play something else up there, apparently.
Okay, let's go for I, see if we have an inventory. Okay, let's go to settings, controls, mouse sensitivity, keyboard mapping. Flashlight is F. They didn't tell me that, so, but I don't have a flash drive just yet. Been working all night, don't wake me up. And that's exactly what we're going to do. I actually noticed that I still have the, uh, the wrong animation, but this is Layer of Fear. So, sorry for that anyway, dudes. <laughs> I had the wrong thing up there. There. So sorry about that. It's been fixed. Sometimes I need to get um, used to the streaming thing, so... Have my have my uh, overlay done right and stuff like that. Okay, the new face of music. Uh, I'm not going to all of that. Let's go. Uh, okay. Look, I can do it with a drawer. Where's the music? I want to hear the music again. Galactic grand opening in flames. Disastrous fire at the new department store leaves dozens fighting for their lives. Uh, apparently, I'm loaded. I am loaded. If I can buy a ring like that, I am loaded. Well, the, m the mansion should already be a hint. Oh, good. Broken mirror. Where's my wife? She was supposed to be here. Agatha! Where are you? Sorry couldn't sleep. The legs been acting up again. Figured I might as well do some work. Love you! Was that mo note from me to her or from her to me? Or maybe I am to her. And I'm an alcoholic. Yeah, let's just remove the evidence. Just close down the evidence. I don't want to be confronted with my drinking problems right now. And it doesn't let me. Well, let, let's guess more bottles? Nope. I don't own many clothes. But I do have a shitload of booze lying around. Okay, so now I think it's probably time to go to the basement. Nice reflection. Or is that a reflection or what is it? Oh, no, we can go a little bit further. We can go over there. See where it takes us. Somebody's playing with a ball? Go to bed, kid. No? Oh, it's Ken. Oh, no. There's a tin soldier. That was one from the previous game, game I reviewed. Wolf. Uh, Close the lights. I'm waiting for a jump scare to come right about now, because I'm in a kid's room and that does not bode well for most horror games. We do have this classical music going on in the background, I like that. It does set a bit of a tune where you're walking through your own house trying to discover your own stuff. And there's an eerie wind. There's an eerie wind blowing outside, but I have no clue where I need to go. We already went here. Why is this on? I'm getting wet feet. Okay, there was a basement here. And we should enter. This already gives me, gives me a little bit of grapes. A mouse! Don't I own a cat? Report card! That's actually better than mine. Excuse from class, physical education. Yeah, that's probably because I had a, have a prosthetic. So how good is my art? A, A, B, A. So but that's what the game is about. It's about art, so that's what I have. Baba. For music. Uh, So I'm a very, I'm a varied student, apparently. Follow the mouse, follow the mouse. Mm. 
Man, I own a lot of stuff. This place should be cleaned. James? James, the basement could do some work. Ah, bloody butler. Don't have any use for it. Let's play a tune. Doom, 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 doom. No, we can't. That would actually be a nice touch. I could play the piano, though, but Ghost just wouldn't let me do it. Okay. Hmm. A Ouija board. Now we're talking. Okay, spirits. Tell me. Yes? No. Is there something? Mm. No pasta for you tonight. Let's go over the letters. Hope it's not too tedious. Nope, 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 nope. Do I have to go over the alphabet every single time? Nah. Oh! Namaste. Yes. Okay, this is a riddle. I have not yet found the answer to. Oh, okay. And the gale exhaled. It's a spirit board. Come, let's try it out. Let's try it out. What could possibly go wrong? So what's the... Do we have any hints on this one? Oh, I don't. So I have to find a clue to the Ouija board. If there's anyone watching who knows this game, you can always tune in and give me... Oh, I don't have... What, the door's locked? Seriously? Oh. I think I'm screwed. Okay. Ah, there's another clue. Then our young friend Gale decided to flee. A reasonable choice. You have to agree. Or more? Let's try. Oh, there's another clue. Okay. Come, little darlings, and hear the tale of three curious children Bobby, Sue, and Gail. Engulfed in darkness, a deep sleep as the night, they stopped a light that shone warm and bright. <clears throat> then Gil exhaled. It's a spirit board. Come, let's try it out. What could possibly go wrong? I know, shouted Sue. Never want to stall. Make me as pretty as a porcelain doll. Then young friend Gil decided to flee. A reasonable choice, you have to agree. Okay. Ah, there's another one. Down into the basement, into the dark. Stormy day, the three rascals. Chance for strain. Okay, that we haven't found all the pages yet, but I think there should be in here somewhere. Try under. There's no place to interact with anything, so I cannot crouch, so I cannot look under the table. Hmm. Turn off the light, maybe? Nope. So I'm kind of stuck. Uh, let's try hello. Hello. No. Just try no. Is there any pointer to this? Uh, <clears throat> I think we have to find the rest of the story, but there's doesn't appear to be any any here. So we got three kids. Yes, they went down the basement. I saw a light that shined bright. Gail exhaled. We still have to find page eight and nine, and we skipped through a lot of it already. So yeah, he fleed. 
Joy, she must. There really something happened between 11 and 10. I think she got into a doll. Maybe. Let's try Sue. Oh, some, something happened here to Sue. No. Gale, maybe? No. One, two, three, four, five? No. Oh, can we move it like this? No. <laughs> Spirits, come on to me. Let me out! Let me out! There's nothing to do here anymore. There's nothing in this room of interest. But you shall not pass. That's actually one of the things I hate now. I have to go into any nook and cranny of this obviously not filled room. There's not much for me to see in here. Unless they keep putting stuff back in. Oh, there's something. Oh, it's an empty drawer. I want you <laughs> to appear. Demon? Behind here? No. It's not letting me out. It's not letting me do anything in the room. So if any watchers have any clue what I'm supposed to be doing right now, that'll be just fine. Okay. Well, I didn't solve the first puzzle, but I think I'm going to do a long play on this game later on. I think I'll do a long play of this game later on, so... If anybody has any reviews, by the way, for this channel, please submit them on YouTube, Facebook, or either Twitch. Um, we will do those next week. There's not much we can do with this Ouija board. I have no clue what I'm supposed to be. Or make me like a porcelain doll? Like doll? Well, there are four chairs. One was knocked over. I think it's one of the, one of the four kids. So something happened to one of the kids in the room with that chair. So, but there's nothing I can interact with. I can't see my feet, by the way. We have no character model for your person. Yeah, this is getting kind of a bore now. But um, what I do like about this game, it it has a nice atmosphere. The modeling is really well done. I uh, love the app. The uh, like I said, the atmosphere is good, the old mansion, the style, it all fits together. This is obviously not made uh, solely from an asset store. Some real serious work went into this. Uh, sometimes I can hear these uh, little sounds, the squeaking of the boards, uh, stuff like that. That'll really help. Um, that's a really nice thing to see in those games. Although I do not like this part where I am actually stuck uh, while not having the entire story. That's probably been scattered throughout the house but I'm I didn't have the chance to look because I was already in this room so let's just go to the menu and let's see what if I can I'm still in the prologue though so that's 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 promising though I would hate for the to, to go through everything again okay when I continue there we have down in the basement in the door so okay that was a story, so we found this part. We haven't opened... Okay, we have to go through everything again. So that's one of the parts that I don't like, where the game actually forces you to go through everything again before you go into the basement. If I went into the basement first thing though it probably would have punished me by not having all the uh, all the drawings that were scattered throughout the house immediately so that's a bit of bad game design there but I'm have full confidence that the story will turn out to be interesting in this game if it's, they've made so much effort into into everything from what I see um, though it's your story I'm kind of doubting that part 
So for our first review, first impression, I would definitely give this game uh, an 8. Uh, it's not the best, or well, no, that would actually be unfair. I would give it a 7. Um, just because it, they're just not really clear what you need to do, you have to look around a lot, and it could be kind of tedious in the beginning. Uh, especially when you get locked in the room when you go there. So that's a thing I wouldn't recommend doing. Uh, for the rest, this game is awesome, especially for the price of $4.99 or $5.5, like I said before. You could go to McDonald's to get a meal, or you could play this game all night. So that's pretty um, It's pretty amazing to, um, to see this game. I'm probably going to do a long play of this, because there is some interesting stuff going on. And I'm just really curious how this is going to end. So that's my review for Layers of Fear. I'm sorry again for not putting the overlay uh, right in the beginning of the video. <coughs> if you like the content of my channel, please go to YouTube and subscribe or uh, like the video if, you've, if you're watching this on YouTube. If you are on Twitch and you like the content, please give me a follow and drop me a message later for next week. Um, I'm going to cut it off with an early... Um, I'm going to cut off this review early, Prob most of the, mostly because one of the game, Eat Munchies, was crashing and didn't start up at the beginning, so that was a bad, uh, a bad deal right there. And, well, thank you for watching, people, and bye-bye, see you next time. <laughs>